I checked back flop because this guy's in the pot. He led small on the, f on the turn. I basically small raised, and I've been playing a lot of weird hands against them. I think he's not folding. Let's go, baby! In the money and fucking chip leading. <laughs> All right, we got a big spot in the 1500. This is my second bullet. I'm squeezing a queen, getting it in. I really hope I'm running into like king queen suited or something. We'd be like best case scenario. All right, it's a big flip. How we doing with the flips today? Not very good. Not very good. Hopefully this one on the river, the queen of clubs. Do the ladies still love the Beruzi? Uh, that's an ace. That's an ace. Yes. Yes. All right, the ladies don't love us, but it looks like the Barrys do. Hey, how you doing? <laughs> Oh shit, can we knock out the ape styles? Look at the, the sick tune comes in when we're about to possibly knock out ape style. I don't want to knock him out. Like, I want to do a, a dual stream with him again. I want to be on good terms with him, you know? Oh, snip, snap, amigos. We got a three way all in with kings. All right. Roosters, attack! Just gotta fade an ace. Just gotta fade an ace. Triple up, motherfuckers! Let's go! Looks like this is our time. We got a massive pot in the satellite here. We induced ace king. We got ace jack to shove for a lot of chips and a 10k satellite. Please, just the deuce of hearts. No. Don't you, don't you fucking dare. Don't you dare talk about pineapple on my pizza. Ever. Deuce of hearts. Yeah! Oh, I'm just gonna bet get an ace king here. Can't really fold. Yeah, like, he has every king jack suited. He's gonna have ace jack sometimes. I block in queen of clubs, ace queen of clubs. He's gonna have nine eight suited sometimes. That also piles it in with a dub double gutter. So, wow, this guy just raised under the gun, called half a stack with queen nine suited, and got it in on a flop. Dude, what the fuck, man? <sighs> We're gonna be going all in here. Oh, this guy? Okay, okay. So this guy's really short and he has a starting bounty. I expect everyone to open super wide. I mean, like, this guy just go three and three. Yeah, yeah. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Double me up. Oh my god, he actually has ace king. Oh my god, hold. I will kiss Ricky in the face. I will kiss Ricky in the face. Okay, okay, we won a couple of big side pots there. There we go. Still on the bubble. It's insane. It's the longest fucking bubble I've, I've ever been on. All right, this is a satellite to the 10K that we're trying to play this today. <laughs> Someone's saying this Jägermeister music is a bit much for us boomers. I am also a boomer, but I'm a boomer that keeps up with the cool kids. You know? Did I really get aces right after? Oh boy! Oh my lordy! Come here! Come here, big boy! Come get some! Yummy, yummy, yum! This is a friend of mine, actually. Oh boy, he's drawing dead. Oh god, why did I say that? Why did I say that? Oh! 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 Quads! Just the daily quads. We're back to daily quads, fellas. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh yeah, feels good. Alright, I'm all in in a W coop, whatever bullshit with Ace Jack suited up against eights. That is not a good start. That is a terrible start. Looks like we're gonna re-enter. Yeah, our favorite sentence. We have aces and we got four bet. Well, I guess we're just gonna flat and call it down a lot. Pretty good flop, especially with the ace of spades. Very unlikely that he has jacks. Like, should never have jacks. Could have queens at some frequency. Kings and ace king, very high frequency. And then he'll have some sometimes like ace five of hearts, ace five of clubs. 
pretty easy call. Uh, King back is kind of cool with the ace of spades. Just not really worried about spades on a river. Okay, nice pot. Ooh, all right, hold on, hold on. First of all, we got ace queen here. Please have ace jack. Yes! Now hold it. Now fucking hold it. No. This is the, the 10k. Why does Nole run so good against me? Fucking bullshit, man. All right, ACR 2650. I know this guy's caught me with something stupid. I know it. Okay, that's not stupid. That's kind of standard. This is stupid, though. The fact that I'm just going to lose again. Unbelievable. Un this, this is such bullshit. Fucking ACR always putting the goddamn queen. God. Motherfucking god damn it. Unbelievable. The shit they put me through. God. No one runs as bad as I do. No one. Not even Spraggy. Oh, yeah. Don't don't mind me. Okay. You got me. You got the whole squad laughing. Oh shit. I'm happy we'd squeeze that off. And that says a lot. I know it, you know it, everybody knows it. Oh, that's a fast... You should call faster. I'm not gonna win this. I know I'm not gonna win this. I, I already feel it. I already feel it. the pain. I already feel the pain. Ah, reverse psychology! Oh, yes, 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 yes! Oh! Okay, we have 60% of a straight flush again, but we also have an actual flush draw and a gut shot. This would probably just be a check get in. Yeah, let's just go. Let's just go for it. Okay, this actually sucks now, but he's gonna bet call King Queen, King 10, and he's gonna fold on a turn. I have Ace Jack, King Jack in my raid, Jack 9. Uh, even Queen Jack, I'm check raising against that size on a flop. So we're just gonna shove here, get some auto folds. We have a lot of equity if we get called. We can also get some better draws to fold. Yeah, he's never gonna fold an ace high flush draw. It's more like getting some like maybe king seven of hearts, king eight of hearts to fold here possibly. But I don't think he bet calls that against my size. Jack ten. Yeah, bink it, baby. All right, I'm punting in the WPT here. Woo, woo. Oh, eat it, pads. Eat it. This nice little punt over there. On the pure bubble, I know he's gonna go after me here with any offsuit ace. So I open, he three bets a third of my stack, and I'm like, uh-uh, motherfucker. I ain't scared. I've seen you. I've seen what you do. You sneaky little tricky man. Oh boy, we're gonna have we're gonna have a spot, it seems. Yeah, I'm just gonna check this down. I, I do think... <sighs> Definitely just checking this down. WPT, we opened 7-6. We bet called the flop. Yes, let's go. It's a fucking massive pot. That's a really big one. Let's go. And this is a really big one. This is a really big one. We didn't get snapped, which is amazing. I mean, he might, he might have pocket tens. He might have pocket tens and nines. Now we want him to call as well. Big fucking flip. No, come on, ladies. Ladies, ladies, I beg you. Oh. Fuck, what a massive fucking pot. All in in a 2650. Ace king versus under the gun. And I think I'm winning this for sure. There's no way I can lose. Yeah. Oh, come on. Oh my god. Like... This is gonna be a tricky spot, for sure. Yeah, I'm gonna have to just flat here. Well, fellas, this is a flop. This is a flop. This is a flop in its native habitat. It's a peculiar creature 
only venturing out after the first round of betting. We're going to get barreled on a lot, so we're just going to check call here. I think I'm just going to check call. He's going to have 10-9 off, 9-8 off, queen-10, ace-10. He, he has flushes too. If I bubble this, I bubble this. There's nothing I can do about it. Good luck. Let's go! Let's fucking go. Yeah, flat, preflop, super standard. Flop a set. Even though it's a wet board, like, it's not, like, it's not really that wet when the opponent is opening insanely wide. Like, he's probably opening around, like, 75% here. And he's gonna be open shoving some hands, uh, like, some suited hands and shit. Like, he can just open shove probably, like, 10-9 suited and stuff there. Anyway, we don't really have a check raising range here because it's on the bubble. We don't even check raise our flush draw. So, like, if I ch start check raising my set, that means I'm just check raising um, value only. So, right, we have to be balanced. Like, I'm not check raising any flush draw here, especially not against the 25% bet. So, very standard check call. Turn, pretty standard. I could, I could consider check shove, but the thing is, like, he just has a lot of air ball and he's going to bluff a lot of rivers as well. So, like... There's no need for us to like protect and whatever. Like I think it's just super standard. And then river super standard. Oh boy. In the 500 W coupe, we have induced a queen suited against Mr. Ruin. Activate the rooster attack. Charge. He has pocket threes. It's pretty uh, massive flip that we lose. I think his shove just is mostly this well i mean it's not disrespectful it just basically means that he thinks i'm squeezing super wide on the pure bubble wpt i flatted deuces against under the gun i checked back flop because this guy's in the pot he led small on the f on the turn i basically small raised and i've been playing a lot of weird hands against them i think he's not folding let's go baby in the money and fucking chip leading oh man this guy went from chip leader to bubble Is that a set? Do we just flop a set? All right, all right. Keep quiet. Let's act like I have a flush draw, okay? It's a secret. Shut up. <laughs> I have a flush draw, okay? Come on, bet. I think I'm just gonna check call. Yeah, I'm just gonna check call. Don't really have many check raises here. Let's go, pocket threes. Ace three, okay. Ah, he has a flush draw too, that sucks. Not sure why he shoved. I don't like his shove, he should just flat. Cause if you like, let's say I have like, let's say I have like nine, seven of spades against this shove, I just fold. 5K main event. Oh my God, please hold. What a punt. This is a 5k buy-in, and the guy just opened ace-8 and fucking 4-bet ripped 60 bigs. Don't do it. Woo! Oh, it's so good to just have a fucking insane image because people just do really crazy shit. Alright, big one. Let's go, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it. Whoa, what a massive pot. I have a top set and we got check raised. I guess we're just gonna call. I have ace queen, ace king a lot. I'm gonna have like some ace 10, king, king 10, queen 10 suited. I mean, I, I guess it's most likely bluff. Oh yeah, now, now I think I just get it in. I think he bet too much, yeah. I think we just get it in. Wow, what a sick cooler for him. All right, in the 10K, my fucking ladies are back. And they're not gonna lose this time. They're not losing to pocket tens. No, nah, they're not. Nah, mate. Not on my watch. Not... <gasps> what the fuck, man? Why is it always in the goddamn 10K that I just can't win any all-in? Like, can't you give your boy Beryuzi a chance in the 10K? Like, why let him always win a seed into the 10K? Oh, nice, thanks. <laughs> thanks, Victor. Thanks, Victor. <laughs> Show the world that I just I'm destined to just donate my fucking money in the 10k. 
I'm so salty about the 10k. Like, that tournament just makes me so salty. You can literally package my sweat and sell it as Himalayan salt right now. Salt, it has something, it has something magical, you know? I mean, it's, it's a magical product. It's beauty and it's pureness. Uh, it, it's, it's very, very appealing for, for a creative to, to work with. My <laughs> Undoable factor i umbúðunum og hvort að væri hægt að actually að leysa hann sko. Það er ekki fljótlega þá hugmynd að, að þú veist, við gætum einhvern veginn með því að brjóta umbúðuna saman þá væri þetta að gera í raunum svona útfellanlega sko. Væri þessi... We didn't want to make just another box, you know. We didn't, we, we thought that the box had to be at the same level as the product. I mean, as, as everything, as, as, as the packaging, as the design, as the, the level very, very high. It's an extraordinary salt, so everything that is close to it, it has to be the same level of, of, of greatness. Every goddamn Sunday I play that tournament, it's just like, oh, build a big stack, oh, get fucking wrecked, oh, run like shit, oh, and they're like, oh, make the final table, oh, get fucked in the ass again. <laughs> like, oh, this one is the special, the special one that's like 10 million guarantee and it's 1 million up top. Oh, how about you final table bubble that three times? Yeah. But everything else is pretty good, so I can't complain. I know you know this man, Beruzi, who is actually going to be guest today. He is a Canadian streamer. Big Beruzi fan. Um, obviously, he's been awesome on the Twitch streets, playing the highest stakes possible. Awesome pickup by GG for sure. Look at oh, this. Wow. Huge moment. Jax too. This is going to be nutty. Wow. Buckle in, chat. Wow. Buckle in is right. Yo, so I'm realizing I am overplaying every holding I've ever had. <laughs> Wow, wow, Jax just calls. Bruzy yeah. play this. Side scene is so interesting, right? It really checked. It was you letting draw seven, eight Jack Ten Clubs. There's a lot going on there. So it does. We're 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 in the matrix right now, and this this is Sergey. <laughs> Sergey gonna see one at least. If you're a Miro, I think you can just get out of the way, God right? What, out. Do you, what do you know? Uh this is this is this is a this is a spot where Sergey could definitely stick on. I was thinking a little size up here as well. Tricky spot here for the Jacks. Ah. So, so Jack 10 comes home, clubs miss. Uh, Sergey does have Jack, so he could rep Jack 10 maybe, but now nah, he's I don't know, Sergey. I don't know if you want to you want to induce those six six eight half, so huh? decent decent size goes a little a little bigger even than half pot but maybe like 55 percent and sergey club in his hands clubs miss i don't love calling here and as we good see ball. the cards good 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 well done i mean it could have been interesting <laughs> they're playing that's hilarious i love that his right you saw him limp in <laughs> He started drinking. This guy is awesome, man. Look at this. Look at this guy. Look at this guy. <laughs> I need to find a hold here. The roosters. The roosters in chat. Let me see you. Ace the roosters. Three, the rooster gang. Ace three, king, queen. Big moment. 1.9 million at risk. And we are going to see a very sweaty flop. 60%. Big turn. 77%. Do you feel it? Can you dig it? Can he hold on the river? And it is a, ooh, felt like a 10 for a second. Canada, but is it a, the rooster's back. The Chat rooster is fire it up. back. Big moment. Superstition's I mean, real. <laughs> Bay Ruzi, nines to tens, just how he dreams it up as one of the chip leaders opening fairly light. He is getting that dream scenario versus two and under. Here it goes. Snap in, and he is saying, OMG, that is right. If you are a rooster fan, it's time to get let me see you chat you have got a tens to nine 3.2 million in the, the dream 
feels almost too good to be true. It's 91% going to now 95.45, 4.55% river card dealer. It is an eight, and that is great if you are a Rooster fan because you have got 3.2 million and you are in business right now in second place. Wow. But ace five is up. Oh, shit. He just committed right into the not now the only I'm so sad it is sick but the the, the 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 part about it that is interesting is i mean ace five suited actually has pretty good equity here and he actually is he gonna fold no he can't no. Right? he put out half his no, stack he's going yeah <sighs> uh, wow you could he's argue ace right? hearts, chat. wow for five million boys and girls oh oh, oh no oh no it was there it was in the window and it is so insane. The 10 comes out too, the oh. ace, everything. Just insane infliction of pain. And, and, and Jeff, you know. speaking of infliction of pain, Archer's not done here. Look at look at my man's GG poker winnings. Number 148 yeah. in the Super Millions. Got real credibility, street cred, and a great player. Give him a fall if you haven't already. We'll have him on a future show as well. GG, bro. And yeah, GG, great.